Well, you may have seen the older video where I had this single tower without the digital timer. And um, that was the original version. With this version, I've added the timer. That's a seven segment LED both on the front and at the back. You can see that over at the mirror. Now let's turn it on. I'm going to plug the, uh, this is the um, adapter. I'm going to plug it in. And upon turn on, the um, traffic light uh, defaults to the blinking or flashing amber mode. <clears throat> and as you can see, the uh, digital timer has that uh, display with a right and left bracket flashing along with the amber bulb. Now, this switch, this momentary contact switch, when I press this, this will change modes. It's going to allow us to change to the different modes. So the second mode, I'm going to press it now, it's going to be the flashing red mode. And as with the flashing amber, you have the right and left brackets flashing along with the bulb. Pressing it again, we now have the uh, alternating red and amber bulbs. And the display has changed to uh, <clears throat> two squares alternating, the top and bottom squares alternating along with the uh, red and amber lights. <clears throat> Pressing the switch again, we enter into the normal traffic light mode. And as you can see, it's counting down. <clears throat> this was set to five seconds. Green goes for five seconds as well. <clears throat> and when the amber light goes on, you can see the, uh, the flashing dash. Now let's change the time. We can change the, uh, <clears throat> the time the uh, red and green lights are on by it. Depressing this and keeping it pressed for about three or four seconds. Okay, I'm going to press it now. And all the lights are going to go out. And you can see the uh, timer there changing for... Those are multiples of five seconds. So let's change that to two. So that's two times five. That uh, gives us 10 seconds. It's going to count down and again to zero. And we're going to change lights. And I'm not going to show all the times here. It's going to just be the same. Now let's change the time to um, 30 seconds. And to do that, we keep this, we press this and keep it pressed for about four seconds. Four, five, six. Six times five is 30 seconds. We release the button and it starts at 30, counting down from 30 seconds down to zero. So I've actually changed the circuitry inside in order to um, accommodate the seven segment digital timer here. And if you want to check out the circuits and a full discussion of the uh, this this traffic light, you can go on to can go visit the website, my blog, which I'll be putting on the um, description down below. I'll probably put some epoxy potting over here to uh, prevent it from being uh, prevented to uh, prevent it from corroding, <clears throat> and I'll probably put a, a ring around this, a rubber ring, because the uh, the children are probably going to knock this thing down so that there's some shock absorber when this thing hits the ground. <clears throat> okay, so that's the uh, new generation traffic light using a signal tower.